you touched on Coast Guard, be there. They are not out here patrolling the streets daily. They are not out here doing investigations daily. So they have more leisure time to work out. They, well, we recently obtained a gym that we believe the officers should utilize. At the same time, we cannot mandate or force anyone to go to a gym because, of course, even the gym have a fee. And if they're already complaining about the expenses without a gym fee, you could imagine the kind of problems we would face forcing or mandating that officers must attend a gym and pay, for argument's sake, $20 per month. Like I said, the department, yes, you are very right in saying that many officers have underlying condition. I didn't come into this department suffering from anything. Of course, I joined at a very young age, and some 25 years later, I do have underlying condition, and it could be attributed to a whole lot of stuff other than just the way you eat and so forth. It could be hereditary for argument's sake. But for us to generalize it, it would be unfair again to the commissioner of police. He has made his best effort to secure a gym that they can actually go in there for an hour a day if they want to, half hour if they want to. And it's always open. We, have a, we actually have a professional um, that runs the gym. If you notice, and I'm very sad to say this because I don't um, support these institutions, but if you pass on Freetown Road in the afternoon time, not only police officers, but a whole lot of other Belize and people at work actually have lines waiting to go and buy these unhealthy, so to speak, food. And um, it is sad that these people cannot go home at lunch for a healthy home-cooked meal.